This year, MSNBC is celebrating the fifth anniversary of the Global Citizens Festival and is once again the media partner for this weekend's concert in New York's Central Park. I'll be hosting along with Willie Geis, and my next guest was part of the festival's host committee last year, and he's participating again this year as well. And joining me live now, Republican Senator Bob Corker of Tennessee, chairman of the Senate Foreign Relations Committee. Senator, thank you so much for your time. Thank you. You've received praise in the past. Uh, I think one article says that you spoke so eloquently about this global outreach to ensure that we provide aid in, in, in the version of food to those starving children around the country, and that's a part right. of the initiative. Right. You, we, uh, you know, we have limited dollars here. We know that. And so what we strive to do is to reform our delivery program so that we're reaching more people. Uh, our food aid reform, which Chris Coons and I worked on in the whole committee and was successful in, uh, in getting that across the floor, enables us to, to feed more people. But we still are very antiquated. Uh, the agriculture community and just the, the maritime community have still hemmed us in to a degree, and we could be so much more efficient. If so, we could serve and feed four to six million people more each year. We've done a great job on helping with clean water. We passed something this year, Electrify Africa, which is going to help 50 million people in sub-Sahara Africa have electricity that have never had it in their lives. And these are the type of initiatives that Republicans and Democrats ought to join together in because it enables us with the same amount of dollars to serve even more people we need we have a lot of work to do but I sure appreciate mm -hmm. what you are doing to support this initiative